What's good YouTube, it's your boy King Kobe and we back with another video. Today we are going to be talking about the five football accessories you need to make sure you're the drippiest athlete on the field. Quick disclaimer, make sure your game is up to par before you get the dressing on drippy or else you're gonna get exposed. But we can't be out here getting exposed. So let's get right into the video. So the first accessory that we want to start with to make sure your drip is up to par on the field is definitely the towels. Why do you need to wear a football towel? Towels are supposed to be used to keep the sweat out of your face and your eyes and things of that nature. But who cares about all that? We wear the towels so we can look the best on the field. Where you gonna wear a towel? You're gonna put the towel in the back of your pants, let it hang out a little bit, right below the back plate. That just add a little more speed, a little more agility, might even make your cut a little better. Just cause you got that towel hanging off the backside. A towel is very necessary if you play a skill position and you don't wanna look like a bum. If you don't wanna look like a bum, you definitely need to put the towels. You can switch it up every game, you know? You might have a white towel one game, or you might pull out the red towel. Depending on your school colors, you wanna have some variety, so have about two or three towels that you can switch up every game. The second accessory that we wanna make sure we have, especially if you're a skill position, definitely arm sleeves. All right, you might be asking, why do I need an arm sleeve if I can just put on turf tape? And um, turf tape is definitely blowing up nowadays, but guys, like, let's just bring the basketball swag to football by putting on the arm sleeves, you feel me? You can switch up the variations on this and you can also diversify it, which is something I like. You can get one arm sleeve on, keep the other arm bare, or you can do two arm sleeves, or you can do one arm sleeve on one arm and bands on the other side or turf tape on the other side. You know, you can switch it up however you would like to switch it up. Just know that this is a necessity. You have to have arm sleeves if you're gonna be in a skilled position. It just gives you a little more flair, a little more swag to your game. And a lot of y'all might need that, you know? Next, we got arm bands. Bands make her dance. Arm bands right here. When you get to college, these gonna take your swag up to the next level. Especially if you've been lifting all off season, the arm bands is gonna be your best friend. Put on the arm bands, if they fit tight, you gonna look like a monster. monster they also girl. bring some variety. You may wear the arm sleeve one day, and next game, you might go arm sleeve on one arm and bands on the other arm. Either way it goes, you need the bands, all right? The bands is gonna bring some swag and some confidence to you. Like Prom used to say, if you look good, and you feel good, then you play good. It's a simple recipe. The next accessory that we have for today, and this is like pretty much a no-brainer, but you know, some people out there, I just don't know if, if you know, I don't know if this goes over your head or not, but hopefully it doesn't. So the next accessory that we're gonna be talking about are gloves. Now I know, I know, I know, you're probably in the comments like, why would he include gloves? Everybody has to have gloves. Like, that's not even an accessory, but it is though. Here's the thing, a lot of people don't wanna wear gloves because they wanna be tough or I don't know the reason. But listen, put on the gloves, all right? Not only is it gonna help you get your interceptions up because you'll actually catch the ball, but it's also just gonna give you a little more flair, a little more swag, make you look a little more official. We got some nice gloves right here. Not gonna cap. If you're not wearing these accessories, then you're gonna look like a bum. There's nothing wrong with looking like a bum if you're good. But if you're not, if you're not like that guy on the team and you're looking like a bum, that's just bad. All right, so the next accessory that we are going to include is the hand warmer. If you're looking at my channel and you're thinking about coming to an Ivy League school, you're gonna be in the Northeast. If you're looking at my channel and you're not thinking about coming to an Ivy and you're thinking about going maybe down south or to the west coast where it's hotter, then this accessory might not be as necessary for you, but it still will upgrade your swag on the field. But this is mostly for my people who are going to cold areas to play football outside. The hand warmer not only will keep your hands warm, yeah. definitely need, but it's also gonna just give you a little more. You walk around with the hand warmer tied around, you can tie it around the front, the back, or the side. 
however you kind of want to do it, whatever your swag like. The hand warmer is definitely necessary if you're going to be out there in the cold and also if you want to look good while you're out there in the cold because the colder the weather gets, the less drippy you get. Pause. When it get real cold, you can't wear armbands or arm sleeves, all that stuff. This could be considered a bonus accessory. We got the headband. Very simple, the headband. So. Headband is gonna give you that extra swag on the field. DB, receiver, running back, whatever, quarterback, whatever. You wanna go out there with the headband because it just look like, it make you look like you the head man in charge. All right, man, look, all jokes is hard. Nothing I say matters if your game isn't up to par. We're not perfect, but you just can't go out there looking like this and you can't play. You gotta make sure you can play. Whatever you gotta do, make sure you get in the field. Make sure you work, man. Make sure you get with a trainer, whatever, watch film, gain weight, whatever you need to do to get on the field and actually play. Make sure you do that, and once you do that, then upgrade your swag and watch your play, watch your game go up too. It's really that simple, folks. That's pretty much all I got for y'all today. Make sure y'all subscribe, click the like button, all that stuff. Let me know what y'all wanna see in the comments. We're gonna come out with more videos. I got a lot of ideas planned out for y'all. With that being said, we out.